All right, so today's Sunday. Uh, probably gonna be a minute before you see this video, but uh, the I went to the show on Saturday, and um, actually Friday I, I worked on my truck when I got off, and um, the center bearing in the drive shaft. And it was brand new. I just put it in and it some spot welds failed on it and then uh, It got in a bind and and ripped apart. So I, I pulled it out Friday while I was working on the truck and welded it up and then I um, Test drove it trying to get it ready to, to drive to the show on Sunday or Saturday rather and um, the transmission started acting funny shifting out erratically and stuff so I couldn't take a chance on driving it and it not making it so I didn't get to drive it to the show I did go to a cruise in um, like three miles away from the house here on um, Saturday afternoon um, I didn't do any video because I kind of got there late and uh, I ran my mouth instead of doing video because I met a lot of cool people, which I probably could have shot a lot more video at the Saturday show. But again, I met a lot of cool people and I talked a lot, so I didn't uh, didn't shoot, shoot a whole bunch of video, but um, had a really good time, seen a lot of cool trucks. Uh, Jonathan's cruise in is tomorrow evening. This that'll be Monday, which, like I said, y'all probably won't see this until um, Monday or something. So, but anyhow, um, the way I'm working, it's probably not going. I'm probably not going to be able to go, which I would again would have to drive the El Camino because I haven't had time to figure out what's what's up with the truck. Um. But uh, I really hate it. I, I've spent today, Sunday, uh, doing chores and, and maintenance on the truck, the, the big truck. So I hadn't, hadn't had time to do anything on this truck. And uh, probably I know at least one evening this week I'm going to have to cut grass and it's just chores and stuff so um i don't know when i'm gonna get back on this uh i might might drag out a core transmission and and rebuild it that way i can just swap one out instead of having to pull it and rebuild it and have it down for an extended amount of time but i still i got my other radiator support that I want to sandblast and then I got the new inner fenders and radiator support that I want to paint and I need to get the passenger side fender off and get uh, my fender patches welded in it and probably will do the inner and outer rocker while I got the fender off um, and, and the cab corner so I mean I've got a lot of work to do of course next Next Saturday is a show really close to my house, so I'm probably going to tear the truck down before then because that's close enough I can drive the truck and it won't be an issue. So, um, like I said, I probably won't won't do any of that yet. Um, which, like I said, I'm not gonna I'm not going to pull the fender and all off until I get the inner fenders and the radiator support painted so and that's not going to happen during the week so and with that car show being saturday i uh, might not get any work done on the truck saturday so i don't know when it just seems like there's not enough hours in the day to get things done but we'll get it done and uh we'll show you as we get it done the el camino uh, made it to this other show um, 
without without any problems at all. Uh, and that's the longest trip it's made since I put the transmission back together in it. So um, it would be nice to to go to Jonathan's cruise in, but his uh, he's sixty something, maybe seventy miles from me. So time I get off of work, I'd be rushing to to get in the truck and go down there, and then I always stay late and. Uh, I'm really, I mean, I want to go, but I'm really leaning towards not going just because, just because of the time factors involved and, and the miles too. I mean, I'll be in the, I'll be in the big truck all day and then have to rush home and, and jump right in the El Camino and ride down there. So. Uh, I've, I've missed quite a few of those shows down there and I really hate it, but um, Anyhow uh, We'll uh, We'll show you more as, as we get more uh, I'll probably add I took a little short a few short clips at the show that I haven't posted yet, so I'll put them on and uh then uh, that'll be something for y'all to watch until I get something else to watch. So y'all stay tuned and we'll show you as we get something to see. Alright, so it's Tuesday evening and I ended up going to Jonathan W's Cruise Inn last night and I got there late and I was starving. I went to get something to eat. And they were out of hamburgers. So I got. Uh, call them walking tacos. I don't know if y'all have ever heard of them. But take a bag of Doritos. And they put taco stuff in it. And um, serve it in the bag. So. Pretty good. I had a couple. Their walking taco combo. Um. And then everybody was between visiting people I hadn't seen in months and and everybody leaving. I, I, I was sorry and didn't shoot any video. But it was a good time. And um, as always, one of the last ones to leave and uh, come home and just got back with it today, another another day on the road, so uh came home this afternoon and did some paperwork and plugged a tire on my pickup. Um not this one. And uh did a little bit of maintenance on the big truck, the Camworth. And, um, chicken chores, of course. And, uh, it's about time to go find something to eat and get a shower and call it a day. So, uh, not very productive. Kind of disappointed in myself that I didn't do any video last night because it was a big turnout. Um, but if you guys watch my channel, Y'all have seen the cars, those all the regular people. And you guys that aren't familiar, I have a playlist of Jonathan's Cruise in. If you'll go to that playlist, you can look through that and pretty much if it's on the playlist, that car was probably there last night. But anyhow, um, got a car show coming up. Saturday that's like three miles from the house and a friend of mine's putting it on and I talked to his grandson Sunday at the little cruise in Sunday and he asked me was I coming and I was like yeah I have to decide what I'm gonna bring and he's like well um 
bring them all. And I was like, well, I'll have to have a ride back to the house. And he's like, well, I'll carry you back to the house. So, But I think I might ask my cousin, since he's been such a big help to me. So if he wants to go to car show with me and drive one of these beasts. So I want to go and I want to carry this and the El Camino. So, I mean, this truck is really not roadworthy, but it's cause it's just three miles. So I don't think it'll be an issue. And uh, so I think that's what we're gonna do. It'll be fun. I mean, I've been working working so hard on this thing and I want I mean I, I've showed you guys if you've been watching but I you know I get a big kick out of sharing and letting other people enjoy so that's kind of where I'm at and what I got going on and like I probably told you in the first part of this video which I made Sunday um, I'll show you more as I go, which I think I tell you that in every video. But anyhow, that's what we got. And when I got more, I'll show you more. So y'all, stay tuned and watch out and see you when we see you.